Hey YouTube, I'm sorry my name is KCAT and welcome back to The Last of Us. Now the last time I walked through a tunnel, it was full of infected. Bloaters, clickers, runners, a lot of them. It sucked. It was scary and last but not least, my face cam crapped out on me while I was recording. We also saw giraffes. That was nice. But this time around, we got, well, Joel got butted in the face by some military guy. This was after he saved Ellie from drowning. Well, he didn't actually save her. He, s he saved her body, but he wasn't able to resuscitate her on the spot because the asshole butted us in the face. This time around, we're going to find out what happens. And I have a feeling that we are going to end the series here or the next episode. So, I hope you guys enjoy, and away we go. Hands in the Just let me air. resuscitate Don't her, you dickbag! <laughs> that is my head. I need it for thinking. I need it for escaping the undead. There is a arm, leg, but it's a butt. Welcome to the Fireflies. I thought you died. Sorry about that. They didn't know who you were. I'm Ellie. She's alright. They brought her back. Thank God. Oh, we can breathe easy. You came all this because way. Because we're a badass. How'd you uh, do it? Badassery. We're a boss. It was her. <clears throat> she fought like hell to get here. Yeah, that too. I mean, remember? She saved Joel. Why? Maybe it was meant to be. <clears throat> I lost most of my crew across in the country. I pretty much lost everything. And then you show up, and somehow we find you just in time to That's save her. That's good. That's definitely good. Maybe it was meant yeah. to be. Fate. Praise Jesus. Or whoever controls fate. Talk. You don't have to worry about her anymore. We'll take care I of her. I worry. Just let me see her, please. You can't. Look worried. She's being prepped Why? for surgery. The hell you mean, surgery? The doctors tell me the cordyceps, the growth inside her, has somehow mutated. Yeah. It's why she's immune. Oh. Once they remove it, they'll be able to reverse engineer a vaccine. Where is it located? A vaccine. But it grows all over the brain. Uh, it does. Wow. That's dark. Joel. Find someone else. Is there too is attached. Else. Listen, you were going to show me where. <clears throat> Stop. I get it. Oh, uh, fuck. But whatever it is you think you're going through right now is nothing to what I have been through. I knew her since she was born. I promised your mother I would look after her. Then why are you letting this happen? Because this isn't about to save me. humanity. Or even her. There is no other choice here. No. Joel is too attached now, oh God. Yeah, you keep telling yourself that bullshit. There's no non invasive surgeries to grab a part of it? March him out of here. He tries anything, shoot him. You guys are gonna die. Don't waste this gift. Joel. Gift to humanity, but not to Joel. Oh no. Get up. Sure. I have no weapons. But you're gonna fucking die. I said get up. He's been through hell for this girl. Go on. And he'll raise hell for her, too. Move. You guys are kind of fucked. Because I'm behind the wheels. I said oh, move. Go fuck yourself. Give me an excuse. Which way? You use your words. We invented a common language. There's my bag.
fuck are you doing? Keep walking. I, I, I said keep walking. Wow, lucky him. Where was the operating room? Thanks. Goodbye. Ooh. Oh, he's gonna definitely raise hell for her. I forgot. How to? Guys over there. <laughs> Going alone is not a smart idea. So far, good. So far, so good. We can create more Molotovs. Nice. Smoke grenades definitely can come in handy. Oh wow. So, machine gun, flamethrower. Feel like a World War II vet. Let's flamethrower for now. There was a guy around here. I swear there was. There he is. You guys scared? There is a lethal weapon coming towards you. Oh, you want to flank me. fucking grenade on them. Ah, uh, well, we're gonna sneak past all of them, but also murder all of them. This is gonna be difficult. Great. Oh, there's a lot of people over there. Let's not be too hasty. This is... Son of a bitch! Okay, nope. 
Warfare for the win. One last, one last guy. <sighs> More assault rifle right ammo. Don't be in surgery yet. Oh, food. Glorious food. I could stab a guy. I could blow up a guy. I can't make any more. No, oh, no. Fuck you. Holy shit. Should you lock it up? Yay! Blocked. Oh, that's a good idea. One man army, Joel coming through. Listen to it. We have all the time. April 28. Marlene was right. The girl's infection is like nothing I've ever seen. The cause of her immunity is uncertain. 
As we've seen in all past cases, the antigenic titers of the patient's cordyceps remain high in both the serum and the cerebrospinal fluid. Blood cultures taken from the patient rapidly grow cordyceps and fungal media in the lab. However, white blood cell lines, including percentages and absolute counts, are completely normal. There is no elevation of pro-inflammatory cytokines, and an MRI of the brain shows no evidence of fungal growth in the limbic regions, which would normally accompany the prodrome of aggression in infected patients. We must find a way to replicate this state under laboratory conditions. We're about to hit a milestone in human history equal to the discovery of penicillin. After years of wandering in circles, we're about to come home, make a difference, yeah. and bring the human race back into control of its own destiny. All of our sacrifices and the hundreds of men and women who've bled for this cause, or worse, will not be in vain. That's too bad. I'm glad no one snuck up on me and stabbed me. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, need a full shiv? You sacks of shat! I think I found a full ship. It's 5.30 p.m. on April 28th. I just finished speaking, I don't know, more like yelling at our head surgeon. Apparently there's no way to extricate the parasite without eliminating the host. Fancy way of saying we gotta kill the fucking kid. And now they're asking for my go-ahead. The tests just keep getting harder and harder. Sorry, Marlene. I'm so tired. I'm exhausted. And I just want this to end. So be it. Poor Marlene. Have to make the most of a terrible, terrible situation. Ah, tape. Always needed that. Ah, fuck! Not enough! I can't make it. I can't get in there. Well, too bad. I couldn't get everything. Bullets. Glass is probably bulletproof, which is dumb. Oh, like. I get to make it get in there after all. Yay. Let's make this quick. Shoot! Yay! Alright. Alright. A pipe. That's what we need. Ammo. Good. Well worth it. And they gave me a little bit of a thing as well. <sighs> what can we get? Fast crafting. Might as well. Like, save point. I needed it. What's this say? Let's read it. I cannot read it. March 15th. We've finally crossed the Utah border. In a couple of days, we'll be back with the others. Today, the crew was in much better spirits. I've been worried about their morale since Greg and Tanya passed last week. It's good to hear them laughing again. Robin came up to me and said thanks for watching over us. Marlene. It was a small gesture, but I needed it. Ellie never made it. Well, damn. We arrived at the hospital, and there was much celebration, at least from the others. I guess they're happy to see the old friends. We haven't seen some of these guys in over ten years. After they told me the news, I couldn't eat. I couldn't talk to anyone. I should be grateful just to be alive, but right now, I just want to shut my eyes for a bit. They look at me, and I know that they're thinking that we're a bunch of incompetent grunts. 
What was I supposed to do? I thought I was going to die. My men were being hunted by an entire Boston battalion. I had to get her out of the city. How was I supposed to know that the Firefly escorts were already dead? God damn it. I panicked in the end and I healed pretty damn quickly. And my men were capable of going. I failed all of us. I'm incompetent, Colant. I can't stand talking to any of them. I don't think I can take the stairs any longer. One of our scouts just radioed in. He spotted an older man and a young girl entering a tunnel by the bus terminal. He thinks she might have had red hair, but not sure. What if it's her? Stop doing this, Marlene. The recon squad is about to head out. I'm going to join them. When we've lost in the when you're lost in the darkness, look at the light. She's alive. They're running the tests on her now. I can tell if I'm I can't tell if I'm excited, scared, or just nervous. All I know is my hands won't stop shaking. Too bad, Marlene. You got between me and my girl. There's something over there! Wow, Joel, great shot. Delicious. Okay. A couple more, and we'll get through. Yay! Almost done. <sighs> Hello, mother. That should buy me some time. I am recording. She's not in here. Okay. Let's go find her. I'm coming, Ellie. Hi, Mom. I'm recording. Oh, don't. Jesus. Doctor? Nope. What are you doing? I won't let you take her. Do you really want to do this? This is our future. Think of all the lives we'll save. Don't. She means a lot to him. I mean. No! You gonna let us through? <laughs> you fucking animal! Jerry, shut the hell up! Come on, baby girl. I got you. I got you. And this is the saddest part. Because. Oh, shit. 
it mimics exactly <laughs> what happened with Sarah. Nope. Sarah, and now he has to save Ellie. That's the worst part. Damn. Hope we've made it. You can't save her. Can. Even if you get her out of here, then what? How long before she's torn to pieces by a pack of clickers? That is, if she hasn't been raped and murdered first. It ain't for you to decide. It's what she'd want. It's not what Joel wants, though. And you know so? it. Look. You can still do the right thing here. He's still not gonna do the right thing. She won't feel anything. So? This is his baby girl. you do for love. And he's still alive, too. Uh, what the hell am I wearing? Just take it easy. Drugs are still wearing off. What happened? We found the fireflies. Turns out there's a whole lot more like you. Sounds really. like a lie to me. People that are immune. There's dozens, actually. I ain't done them a damn bit of good, neither. They've actually... They've stopped looking for a cure. Oh, they didn't. You just shot the only person caring. I'm taking us home. Where's home? Are we going to Tommy's? I'm sorry. That stings. <laughs> Wait. Let me go. Hi. You'll come after Ellie again. You just come after her. Objectively, well, not even objectively, like, that's not even truly objective. But, Joel did what was right for him, but not right for the human race. But, I'm pretty sure... Well, that looks worse. Looks like we're walking. Should be a straight shot through here. I am here. Ellie. Alright. And that's... That's actually kind of pretty, yeah, it ain't is. it? Yeah. Did you figure it out, Ellie? You okay, Ellie? Alright. Now watch your head going through. Wow. Here. We're working Got together. Feeling my age now. In the trailer, we saw Ellie, and it looks... I don't think I ever told you, but, uh... Sarah and I used to take hikes like this. I think, uh... I think the two of you would have been 
Would have been good friends. I think you really would have liked her. I know she'd have liked you. I bet I would have. Sad. Train of thought lost for a moment. Let me think back. Yeah, he did what was good for him. But not for good for the human race. And, uh... In The Last of Us number two is coming out. And that's... That's pretty cool. I'm excited to see what happens to Ellie. It looks like Joel may have died, but Ellie also got tats. We're down there. It's home. It actually looks. It's a little bit further now. Like the infection is getting worse on Ellie, though. She's not truly immune. Maybe it's just prolonged. The hope is that she doesn't lose her mind, though. Overall, I, I'd say the gameplay on this game is good. Like, I felt I got pretty you. good challenge in doing it. In your hands. The story was well thought out. Pulls at your emotional. Right, come on. Pulls at your heart. Hey, wait. What? Back in Boston? Back when I was bitten? I wasn't alone. My best friend was there. We saw that. And she got bit too. That's the sad part. We didn't know what to do. So... She says... Let's just wait it out. You know, we can be all poetic and just lose our minds together. I'm still waiting for my turn. Ellie. Her name was Riley, and she was the first to die. And then it was Tess. And then Sam. None of that is on you. You don't understand. I struggled for a long time with surviving. And you... No matter what... You keep finding something to fight for. Now, I know that's not what you want to hear right now. Swear to me. What? Swear to me that everything that you've said about the Fireflies is true. What part? I swear. doesn't want to repeat incident of Sarah. Oh my god, that was so touching and dramatic. And now number two is coming out. And I can't wait what they do with the story. And I feel like they're going to make it a trilogy though. Like every time they say that they're finishing a series, then they come back with uh, number two. Fans will yell for number three. I think that's going to be it for this series. I hope you all enjoyed. And this is Kaycott, signing off.